Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In this video, we are going to install a free plugin which will give you an option to set up Quick View on the WooCommerce website. So on the shop page, you can add Quick View button like this. So when you click on it, it will show the quick view of that particular product. So people do not need to leave your products page and they do not need to click on each product to see the details of the product. So this is the quick view of the product and here they can scroll to the next product. So it will show the next product details in the quick view. The advantage of using quick view is that people do not need to go to each product to see the details of the product. They can also add the product to the cart here. If they want to see the full details of the product, they can click on it and it will go to the product page. So we can have two different types of quick view. This is the pop-up type quick view. Now let me show you the second type of quick view. So when I click on it, you will see the quick view in the sidebar. So people will be able to see the quick view in the sidebar. If they want to see the full details, they can click on it. So there will be two types of quick views. The first one will be a pop-up window and the second one will be the sidebar window. So let's see how does this work. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So I'm logged into the dashboard of the WooCommerce website and we are going to install a free plugin which will give you an option to set up a smart quick view on the WooCommerce website. So let's start with the installation of the free plugin. I'm on the plugins page, click on add new. Now search for WPC smart quick view. So this is the plugin WPC smart quick view for WooCommerce we are going to install on the website designed by WP Clever. So click on install now. Click on activate. All right, so the plugin has been activated. Here you will see the option WP Clever. If you go to this, you will see the option Smart Quick View. So we are going to set up this plugin first. We are going to change the settings. This plugin will give you two different types of Smart View or the Quick View. So let's start with the first one button so we are going to add a button for this smart view so if you have any extra class for the button you can enter the class otherwise it will take the button from your theme so it will for this theme this is the layout of the button so it will take the same layout for the button okay now this is the position where do you want to show the quick view button so right now it is set to under add to cart so these are the different positions where you can set up this button so I'm going to set up under add to cart so what type of quick view you want to show? Pop-up or sidebar? So let's start with the pop-up first. I have selected pop-up. So this is the pop-up effect, fade, zoom in, zoom out, newspaper. So these are different types of animation effects that you can use. So right now it is set to 3D unfold. I'm going to set the same one. And this is use perfect scroll bar. So this will be about the scroll bar. I'll show you how does this work. And where do you want to show? all categories you can set up the categories also so right now it is set to all categories so it will be shown on all the categories now these are the settings images which images do you want to show on the quick view it can be product image itself or you can also show the product gallery images so we are going to set up both image size so this is the size so i'm going to leave it on the default settings product image effect light box or zoom so let's see you can select light box. Now this is the product summary that will be shown on the quick view. Title, rating, price, short description, add to cart and meta. And if you want to show description, you can show the description. I'm going to uncheck meta. Do you want to show add to cart button like single page? So I'm going to set it up as single page. Related products. If you have any related products, it will show the related products. So I'm not going to set up the related product because this will be a quick view. Now view details button. So if they were have to go, they can simply go to the product page. Let's save the changes. Now this is the default shop page on this WooCommerce website. I'm going to refresh it because we have just installed the plugin. So refresh this page. Now here you will see the option quick view. So this is the button added by this plugin. So let me click on it. 
Now this is the quick view. So this is the title, the price, the short description, add to cart, and this is meta. Okay. Now this is the page scroll. So people can also see the other products from here. So it will go to the next product. So instead of leaving this shop page or the category page, customer will be able to simply view the product using quick view. All right, so this is the first layout. Now let's go ahead and select the second layout. Now let's change the view type to sidebar. So we are going to select sidebar view type and the position will be on the right side. Sidebar heading no. Use perfect scroll bar, yes. So other settings, we will keep them as default and click on save changes. So this is the second type of quick view that we are setting up. Now let's go to the products page and refresh it. Okay, now let's click on quick view and you will see the quick view on the sidebar. Okay, they can close it. Now let's go to the next one, quick view. Here they will be able to see the quick view of the product in sidebar. All right, let's try and set up the view details button. Click save changes. Let's go ahead and refresh the page. Click on quick view. And here you will see the option view product details. So people will be able to click on it and it will go to that particular product page. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section. And press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.